Estimated 47 million people worldwide are living with dementia in 2015, and the number is predicted to be uh, triple that in 2050. Uh, of course, they're trying to develop medications for it and things, and they're having almost zero luck at doing that. Now, what is ApoE4? That is one of the genetic SNPs. A SNP is a single nucleotide polymorphism with here. We're trying to reduce inflammation with natural substances where we get complete healing first, and then we reduce, we allow our body to reduce the inflammation naturally. What you eat makes a difference. The yellow curry spice, a curcumin, has both antioxidant and anti-inflammatory activity. It lowers destructive inflammation. Now this is interesting. It tags those plaques we were talking about earlier, the amyloid plaques, for destruction. Here it is. All those medications have a very high probability of increasing a person's dementia. You realize that when you kill off the source of glucose, you are doing something very harmful to the future of your brain. And that comes as a result of antibiotics. And by the way, who, has, who does the most antibiotics? The elderly. You're using right. ketones as your primary fuel source. And that, by the way, has taken people who have had long-term dementia and actually helped them wake back up again. Be on a ketogenic diet or having source of, of dietary ketones.